So we are rigged and ready, we're just waiting for wind, it's going to be the first day of racing today. Forecast looks promising, so yeah, can't wait to go racing. Lena Erdl up the top end of the fleet, we've got the north sails of Mortifon, Gibson in the middle, the Hoos as well on the north. Uh, on the S2 Maui sails we've got uh, Cousin, but she's trailing at the moment and it looks to me like it's going to be Lena Erdl going round in first, so Lena in first. Delfin Cousin in uh, second place, good jibe from her. Then we've got Mortifon, then we've got Lilu Granier, we've got Gibson behind her. And uh, Fully Onlu is actually quite deep at the moment, she's back in about seventh place. Uh, Esther de Hoos in eighth at the moment. And Delfin Cousin Castell leading. Lena Erdl went round the first mark in first place. But uh, it was a little bit light and she's lost out to Cousin Castell. Second in the world last year, Delphi Cousin, these two have got history together. They're always fighting it out at the top. You can never count them out, that is for sure. She has been world champ before, Delphi. She'll be looking for another title this year, especially with Sarah Keita not doing the full tour. So Delphi round in first, Lena in second. Then we've got uh, Marion Mortifon in third, Lilu Granier in fourth. Then we've got Fulia Onu catching up in fifth place. Gibo on the loft, not the best jibe from her. Gibson just behind and then Esther de Hoos. It's tight at the front as you can see. Second, third and fourth from last year in the overall championship sitting in first, second and third in this opening heat and I tell you what, Lena Erdl is absolutely making up ground on Delphine Cousin on this reach she has got the speed and I think she's going to go round in first place so she's done well to catch up, she's going to squeeze her a little bit now it's going to be close but it's going to be Lena who goes round in first but Delphine takes the inside line a better line in from the giant from Delphine and she cuts back inside Lena Erdl, what a great race from the women uh, Marion Waterfon in third place, Lilu Granier in fourth, Fulia Onlu in fifth place in the women's final elimination one here in Japan for the Fly ANA Windsurfing World Cup. This is to see who is going to win the first race of 2018. At the moment, it looks like the Frenchie. Delphine Cousin Castell leading. She hasn't had it all her own way in this race though because Lena Erdl has been pushing her hard and she's pushing even harder now coming into the last jibe mark. It's all going to be on this last jibe. Gets it right, she's going to win the final. Here she goes. Round, clean jibe from Delphine. Good jibe from Lena Erdl but you've got to say that's Delphine's race to lose now. In control coming down this last reach, holding the up all. We've seen that from a few of the top men. One in particular, Finney and Maynard. But uh, Delphin Cousin leading now. Lena Erdl in second, Marion Mortifon in third. At the end of day one, today we managed to do one final and I finished second. Started in first place and drive them first and then started going to the wrong mark. So I lost some distance. Halfway I realized uh, that I had to go down. Um, and unfortunately by that time Delphine had caught up. 
and then uh, I finished second behind her in the end. But I was really happy with my um, straight line speed. So I'm looking forward to more racing. We had a great battle and uh, yeah, fun. Good to see Japan this way. Forecast looks good for the next days. Stay tuned. Round to Fuji. to have a little peek like that <laughs> but uh, not more uh, apparently there's been some radical changes and he's super happy with it so yeah get excited for next year's 0.7 range <laughs> lunch time in Japan <laughs> We did some races, but hopefully in the afternoon the wind is coming back and to finish uh, the elimination. So, we just had some measurements being done to the boards. Turns out our D boards are three millimeters too wide, so the guys are just uh, sanding off the edges a bit. Epic day. Um, <laughs> it's turned out to be not so epic. I think that for today it's finished. So take a look outside. So this is what it looks like outside now. The wind is completely stopped. So it's the last day in Japan. We are waiting for wind. The foil racing is on. Last start is at uh, 1.30. Uh, so that's in two hours. It's quite nerve-wracking. I hope we can race again.